Hey, y'all. How's it going? Did everybody have a good week? Happy Friday. Whoop, whoop. Do your happy Friday dance. It's happy Friday. And I told you I'd be back when I closed this uh, other party for my friend. And um, she got a couple warmers. Actually, she got three warmers. And one of them was half price. So she ordered a couple and she got a half price. So um, I'll show you that stuff. I'll show you the warmers I got. And I've got a surprise warmer that I got. And I've got a couple of the new um, diffuser fans that are out. Just came out this week. And I ordered a couple of those. Friend of mine ordered hers. And I ordered one for my grandbaby boys. And I ordered one for Jordan. Jordan's going to have one in his bathroom. They're super duper cute. I think y'all are going to love them. So I hope some people can jump on here and check this stuff out. And if you do jump on, please say hello and let me know who's watching. Okay? All right, here we go. We're going to jump right in. Um, first of all, I'll get this, this stuff out of the way. I got some, uh, some pods because I do have the new, um, fan diffuser for Jordan's bathroom. So I got three sets of pods for him. I got jammy time. I got mystery man and I have clothesline and jammy time. Um, jammy time. If you remember from my last live, I got the jammy time laundry and I'm going to strip beds tomorrow and um, wash everybody's sheets in the jammy time. It's going to smell really good. Really, really good. Um, and I got some uh, scent packs for, you know, like the um, your sock drawer, underwear drawer. Makes, makes everything smell real good. I got Aloha Citrus. I got Atlantic Air. And I got Now and Zen scent packs. And these are real good to put in your car, too. If you've got like a console, just drop it right down in your console. And um, makes everything smell great. So I wanted to clean my car out tomorrow, vacuum it, and clean all the upholstery and all the leather and everything. But Kelly says it's going to rain, so I might not get to do that. But I'm going to wait and put one of these in my car when I clean it up. That'll be good. Um, all right. And as always, as always, I got scent circles. Always buying scent circles. They're great to put in Happy Mail. They're great to hang in your house, hang in your car. Hang in your closet. They're awesome. So I all the time try to have um, scent circles. And I had a few dollars left, so I got the Go Go Mango uh, shower gel. I hadn't tried this one yet, but I love Go Go Mango, so I'm pretty sure I'm going to like this one. Um, and I got a, uh, some three bars because I did get a couple new warmers. I got uh, rainbows and butterflies. I got uh, Mad for Melon, and I got Peach Nectar. And this Peach Nectar, I hadn't, I've got the testers, but mm, sometimes you just need the whole, the whole bar to really get the effect. And I can't wait to warm these. But this Peach Nectar, mm, mm, mm. oh, it smells so good. It's a real pretty coral orange color. I'm spitting everywhere. Jeez, Janet. Okay, I got that stuff out of the way. Let me move these. Got that stuff out of the way. Now, I think I'm going to show you what else I got. Now, these belong to um, a friend of mine. And she ordered them, and she cannot wait to get her hands on them. Um, so, I guess I will, she'll get them on Monday. But I'm going to show them to you guys right now. And here they are. These are the new fan diffusers, guys. Um, I posted about it. I'll let you know about it. But these are them in person. You ready? Spider-Man and the Disney princesses. Now we've got, uh, is that, I guess that's Belle. And Beauty and the Beast. That's, no, that's Belle. Who is, who is that one with the red hair? What's her name? 
Is that Little Mermaid? That might be. And then Cinderella is on the other side. So that's, is that not cute? That's going to go in the bathroom for her little girl. And she's going to swap them out, I guess. And Spidey, of course, is for the little boy. It's a fan diffuser. It works just like the other ones. It has the fan inside. You, you put the pods in there. This is the pods that I bought. And Spidey goes on top. And these are good, hard plastic. It's not glass. It's not going to break if you drop it on the floor. It's really, really hard plastic, good quality. And these are the bomb. They just pop right down on top. There it is. And this is your on and off button when you plug it up. Now, guys, these don't have a light in them. The only light you're going to see is the little light around where you turn it off and on. So you don't have to unplug it, plug it back up all, all the time to turn it off and on. And um, they work just like our other fan diffusers. They have the button on the bottom. And you can turn this around so your grounding prong matches however your plugs are. If they're on the bottom or if they're on the top or if they're sideways. Just push that little button and turn this around. And sometimes you got to have two hands to work it. Oh, I see. you got to go back the other way to get it to turn. It only goes one way. And it snaps in place. You can hear it. But that's how that works. And then um, the Disney Princesses works the same way. It's got the same little button on the bottom. So you plug these up. And I'll plug one up for you just to show you. There. There it is on. If you can tell. This little thing is, is lit up. It's kind of hard to tell with that light blue. There it is. And it's off. And it doesn't have a light inside. Nothing. Doesn't have a light at all. But it just puts that fragrance out. And I can even feel that fan blowing. It's good. It's a good little fan. And you can kind of hear it blowing. But that's, that's the way those work. Maybe they'll come out with one that puts off a little light later on but this is these do not have a light and there you can see his light a little better because it's darker but that's on and that's off it would be kind of cool if his eyes lit up or something wouldn't it i like that i think they'll do that eventually with something i don't know that it'll be these but i think they'll do that with something but i think that'd be real pretty if there was a light behind the eyes and maybe a light on each one of the princesses that'd be really pretty That'd be really pretty. Of course, it'd be a lot more expensive, but these are thirty-five a piece because they're they're extra. They're they're extra. They're special. So these are thirty-five a piece, okay? Instead of twenty-five or thirty. Well, thirty is the one with the lights. So these are thirty-five because they're Disney and Marvel and they're extra, okay? So Spidey is always extra, and the you know the Disney princesses they are way extra. So they're a little more. But that's those, and with the new um, with the new fan diffusers, they have new pods. Now we already have this fragrance. We already have the Marvel Nine Realms in a in a wax bar. This is the Marvel Nine Realms in a in a scent pod. Okay, that's what go in inside those those fan diffusers, and I'll show you in case you haven't seen one before. But that's what it looks like inside. There's your fan. You just drop those little set packs in there. And it doesn't matter if you put them in up just like that or if you put them in like that. Doesn't make any difference because they've got they're open all the way around it. And then you put Spidey back on top and you plug it in. And then the fan will blow and blow right up through these um, through these little um, scented scented beads. And it puts the fragrance out in your bathroom or in your bedroom, wherever you put Spidey for your little boy or little girl. Either one. Not going to be like that. Okay. So that's that. Now this one is Jordan, so I'm just going to lay him over here to the side and we'll put him in his bathroom a little later on. And I'm going to... Now this one I will show you on the, on the Princess. 
this little thing comes off the top and there's where your pods go in this one it comes off just like spidey does it was right on there and now i will tell you it's got these little these little things that click up right there so and it has on the inside you can see those little places you kind of have to work with it a little bit and get it to where it's just supposed to fit down in there and it will go and be flush but see how cute that is that's just flipping adorable you all I love it. I don't have any little girls running around here, but I'm telling you, I like this one a lot. I like it a lot. So that goes back in here, and I'm not going to make y'all watch me package it back up. I will just lay it right over here, and my friend will get her stuff on Monday when we go back to work. Now, um, also with the, with the, um, the Princess uh, Diffuser, they've got a new scent for her. It is called Disney Princess True Love Awaits. And that comes in the pods and also in a wax bar. True Love Awaits. And let me get my phone and I'll tell you what, that's, what that smells like. Because I pulled it up earlier. True Love Awaits. It says, Enter a kingdom where enchanting ripe raspberry, sparkling mandarin, and a kiss of sweet vanilla write the perfect fairy tale ending. Now that's what the True Love Awaits bar smells like. And the pods. Okay? So it's got raspberry and mandarin. Oh, and it's a beautiful, kind of a medium mauve pink color. I got three bars. Three bars. And I'm going to warm it, and then I'll decide whether or not it's going to go in my club. My Scentsy Club. If y'all don't have a Scentsy Club, I don't know what you're waiting on. I've beat, this, I've beat this dead horse before. I can't tell you enough about it. Okay, now we're going to get into the warmers. And, yes, we're going to get into the warmers. Okay, now I've already got a couple of them put together and plugged up so you don't have to wait on me to unwrap them all okay now this one's called bless this home and it is absolutely gorgeous i'm going to set it up on top of this yeah maybe like that but this is called bless this home and it is really super cute it would look great in like a a farmhouse or a, a pretty white kitchen even any color kitchen, but because it's white, but it's gorgeous. I love it. Um, let me plug it up. Look at that. Woo, it's bright. We got bright in here. There we go. Get it a little closer and the camera will, will focus. But there is Bless This Home. And you can see all the little, the little windows around and the bless this home is cut out as well and it goes all the way around and you've got these uh little holes up here on top where your fragrance can come out and then you can see the top of it's got a hole in the little chimney for the home and then this is your this is where your wax is going to go and there is a four on the bottom of this pretty dish and that is, remember to tell you that Cincy says no more than four wax bars, four wax bars, whoa, four cubes of wax from a wax bar in these dishes because you will have a wax in. Okay, so that goes right on top right there. And this goes right on top of that. And there it is. Absolutely beautiful. Bless this home. Now that gives off a lot of light, you guys. That's a bright warmer. It's beautiful. Beautiful. All right. So that one's that. Let me turn it back off. Okay. I'm going to sit that one right there and I'll repackage it up. Now she got, uh, I think she's going to use those maybe as gifts. So she got two of those. But this is the one I think she got for her. 
and this is called the Nova Warmer. Now there's one called Stargaze, I think, that's a little shaped a little different than this one, but this one is the Nova. And it looks, it's, it's a real pretty blue color. You can see how pretty blue this dish is, gorgeous. And it also has a four. So that goes there. And now, y'all aren't gonna believe how cool this is when I plug it up. I hope you can see it, you ready? That is too cool. I mean, look. Let me turn that light off right there. You can be able to see it a little better, maybe. Okay. Isn't that pretty? Were you still? It's the light from my light from my window. That's the glare from my window. Sorry, but you can you can tell. It looks like my um, my diffuser shade that is like this. Remember. And my diffuser shade makes different colors because it's on the diffuser, but this one does not. This one is just from the light bulb that's inside. It's a 20 watt light bulb. So it's not a real, real bright one. This isn't gonna be a real, real bright warmer, but it's gorgeous. I love it. It's got all different colors in it. Absolutely beautiful. I love that. And it's not real, real big. I love the shape of it. It's kind of big at the bottom, gets small on the as it goes up, has a little tapered. It's beautiful though. Smooth glass. I love it. I love that 3D effect that it gives you. Isn't that beautiful? I love it. Okay. And I think that uh, Linda's going to love it too. And I tagged her in this so she might get a little sneak peek of her warmers if she jumps on here and watches. So that's Linda's. And I'm going to set it over here. And I'll repackage that up for her, too. And we'll take them to church with me and give them to her uh, at church. Okay. So there's that one. Now, those were Linda's warmers. <coughs> this one is mine. And it's not a new warmer. This one is not a new warmer. But I haven't opened it yet. But I've, it's one that was there last fall. But I have had my eye on it had my eye on it and I think it may have went out of stock for a little while and um, they've got it back now so we're going to open it up and take a look at it it's called bubbled bubbled ultraviolet is what this is called Ooh, get that kind of a pink purple but, uh, dish there y'all look at the color this takes a uh, 25 watt bulb so now this is going to be a bright one this is going to be a bright warmer but we're going to open it up and put it right together and see what it looks like because I cannot even stand it to see what it looks like. And I know somebody else that had their eye on this is Billy. And I think I tagged her in this too. But I think she had her eye on this when she had her party last year. And maybe she might need to have another party is all I'm going to say. With this little beauty three or half price. Okay, where's my dish? Here it is. There's that. That. Let me drive the plastic out of my way. I'm going to set it right up here for you. Okay, now this one's going to be bright. I don't know if you'll be able to tell anything about it or not, but we're going to try it. Bubbled Ultraviolet is what it's called. Whew, that one's bright. That one is a bright one. But it's purple... And it has this um, this bubbled effect on it. It um, it has these little these little round um, 
these little rounds you can see where my thumb's moving around there's a circle there and it kind of goes in you can tell how my thumb is kind of going in right there these are those are all the way around it everywhere all in here there's one up there it's called bubbled ultraviolet and that's what it kind of looks like is is bubbles but that's beautiful i love that purple color oh i'm so glad i got that i'm so glad i don't know if you'd be able to tell much about it if i got it closer but you can tell that it's kind of kind of bubbled it looks just kind of kind of bubbled i love it so glad i got that okay oh oh now i'm sun blinded that's gorgeous okay let's put this back down here all right guys now i'm going to show you the other one i got and this is a super special one super special are you ready nfl warmers yes they do have them NFL warmers. Did you hear what I said? Now, does anybody want to guess the one that I've got? Anybody know me out there at all? Does anybody know what football team, the only football team that I would have purchased a warmer? Do you have any idea? And I'm sorry if you're not a fan. I'm sorry if you think they suck. <laughs> but you could not grow up in my father's house and not be a fan of this team, okay? Because the man was born in Pittsburgh. So, you had to be a Steelers fan. I grew up with that embedded into my soul, my people. Embedded in my soul. So, I have to be a fan. I can't help it. It's the way I was raised. Okay, and now this is the little dish. And all of the warmers have this dish, okay? But it just has a different little, they're different little emblem. But this is the Steelers. And then the Patriots will have the Patriot emblem. Cowboys will have the Cowboys. Um, the Chiefs will have their Chief, whatever. And it's adorable. It, it is, it is so awesome. I love this so much. Okay. Oh. Y'all, I'm shaking like a new puppy. I don't know if I can handle it or not. Oh, I think this is a 25 watt warmer. Is it 25? Yes, 25 watt warmer. Right. Oh. I don't even know. I don't even know how to act. Don't even know how to act. Y'all. Hmm. Oh my Atlanta. Look at it. Look at it. Just look at it. Now this is not going to be a very bright warmer, but it's oh y'all. I don't even know how to how to explain to you what this does to me. This is just so many memories of my childhood. So many memories with my dad watching football. I don't know. The Steelers just give me such a happy heart because it reminds me of my dad so much. And I love it. Okay. And there we go. And now we're going to put, now this, it says not for food use. So that's a little sticker that's on there. And we're going to peel it right off because nobody's going to use it for food. But that's going to sit right up there. And does it have a, it doesn't have a fork. Does it have anything on it? Because it would, it would mess up your, would mess up your little football field. So it does not have a four. But I will say that it is a small dish. And I definitely wouldn't put four in this for real. I tend to go with two. Just like I've told you guys before. I tend to go with two. And this is Two is plenty for this. Plenty. So that's going to go in there. Oh, and we're going to plug it up. Okay, ready, ready. Here we go. Oh, is it not looking 
did I put the did I forget to put the light in there? I did forget to put the light in there, y'all. Y'all sit right there and let me do it too. Looking like a fool. Y'all sit right there and let me do it. You're probably laughing. That's all right. I laughed too. I thought I got one that wasn't working. I was about to have a little spell. Whew. Of course, you know, you know, if you ever get a light bulb that's that's burnt out or whatever that you've ordered from me, you can call Cincy or I can call Cincy and they'll send you another one. But what would be easier than that is just saying, hey, Janet, my light bulbs burn out because I tend to keep a few. So I could probably help you out with that. Okay, here we go. It's on. It's on, but I told you. It's not a bright one. You can't even tell from the bit from the front that it's on. Unless you look at the top with the dish. But you've got holes back here. You've got holes back here that let out a little bit of light. There it is. And this is it. This is my Steelers warmer. And I love it. Do you hear what I'm telling you? I love it. And because, because it's the NFL football warmers, since he has, and this is this has been out for a little while. Actually, these warmers came out last fall, and they went out of stock really quick, and now they're back. But, but this bar did not go out of stock. They've had this bar. Now, with this um, launch again, the relaunch, I guess, of these warmers, um, this may go away now. I don't know. But I like it, and um, I hope it doesn't go away or it'll go in my club. Um, but it is the NFL licensed NFL bar, and it's called Gridiron Rush. And you got to have Gridiron Rush if you're going to have an NFL warmer. I mean, what are you thinking? You got to. And that see, that sends me back to where I said I was going to have a problem with these warmers. And since he's, because, I think because I have an NFL warmer, I have to warm the NFL wax in the NFL warmer. I'm just weird like that. And, but, you don't have to do that. You can put Paradise Punch in this if you want to. And I can put Gridiron Rush in my bubbled warmer if I want to. It's a little weird to me, but you can do it. Okay. Mm, that's what this is. This is. Mm. And I will tell you right now, my friends, what this smells like. And no, it doesn't smell like dirty gym socks or a locker room. Okay does not. But I will tell you what it smells like. Okay. Oh, yes you can. Okay. Well, there's all the teams. All the teams that they've got. They've got bunches of them. Bunches of them. Um, there it is. Gridiron Rush. Um, it is supercharged citrus and crisp apple. Set the stage for game day on the gridiron. While a dash of fresh cut grass and sleek sandalwood surge into the end zone. Now. That's probably why I like this, is because of the sandalwood. Mm, I love those sandalwood scents. Gridiron Rush. If y'all have not tried it, you need to try it. Okay. Now, you guys, I know y'all are still there, but I went off. There we go. I'm back. Um, that was my phone. Um, yeah, Gridiron Rush. If you don't get your, if you, if you don't get a warmer, at least get a bar and try it, okay? 
it's a fresh kind of a manly scent i guess oh but it smells so good it could be for your girls too mm -mm 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 -mm. i love it love it and you can best bet that this fall when this old girl is watching football i'm gonna have some gridiron rush and my steelers warmer even if the steelers ain't playing i'm still gonna be warming my gridiron rush so there we go now it just makes my heart happy you guys y'all don't understand do you if you're a football girl and you grew up watching a certain team and it's still your favorite no matter what no matter win or lose it don't matter if you get that then you understand what I'm talking about right now if you don't get that or you don't watch football I can't help you. I don't know how to make you understand how it feels. But this makes my heart happy. I absolutely, it just makes my heart happy. I love it. Okay, that's all I, that's all I know to say. Okay. Um, and I think, guys, is that all I've got? I think it is. I think that's all i got for you guys tonight. Um, I've still got a few things coming. Um, oh, and my, um, remember when they did the pre-sale of um, Sebastian the Crab, Scentsy Buddy, and the Lady and the Tramp Scentsy Buddies? Remember that? And that was just a few weeks ago, and we didn't think they'd be in until October. Guess what? Emails went out, and some people are able to get them right now. And I think the way since he said, if you ordered it, like if you pre-ordered it early, like the day it came out, then you get to get yours first. So if you waited a little while before you ordered your pre-order, then you'll have to wait a little while to get it. But I got on there the day that they came out and pre-ordered mine. So I've got Sebastian, Lady, and Tramp coming. Um, hopefully next week, they'll be shipping out. Either today or maybe Monday. I don't know. Now the net, the the um, what am I trying to say? The corporate office in Idaho, Cincy, they do not um, work on the weekends. I think it's a great gig, but they don't work on the weekends, so they don't have anything shipping out on Saturdays or you know unless they've um, printed off the unless they've got it out this evening late, then it might show up Saturday as shipped. But um, they're not there on the weekends, so you can't even get a hold of customer customer support um, at Cincy on the weekends. You can't do it. So um, they, I don't look for any activity on the weekends, shipping or printed or posted or any of that, because um, they're not there. You can order on the weekends, and your and your order sits there until they come in um, on Monday morning, and then they then they start working on it. But um, no, you can't, you can't do anything on the week or they don't do anything on the weekends there. Um, now the only time I think they're there on the weekends is when there's going to be a launch on Monday and maybe they're there on the weekends getting things ready. If it's going to be a big one, I don't know, but that would be the only time I would think that they would be there. And, um, and still that's just to do that. That's not to answer phones and, and deal with us. So, <laughs> um, but anyway, I just wanted to show you guys. Um, Spidey and the, and the Princess and all that is still available right now. You can get on my website and um, and get your get you Spider-Man or the Princess um, fan diffusers or you can get on there and get you a Steelers warmer or any of the other NFL teams and I think they're all still available. Um, Gridiron Rush obviously is still available. Um, and yeah. So get on there and take a look and see what you can find. And if you want, um, I told you about this last time, if you want a personal shopping link sent to you in your in your text messages, uh, message me and um, let me know that you want a personal shopping link sent to you and I'll send it to you. You can pass it out to your friends, family. Just, you know, it doesn't have to be anything big. Just get a couple hundred dollars worth of orders. You can get $20 in free and a half price item with a $200 um, event, 
or you can keep going. We'll leave it up for a month and see how many orders you can get. And the, the more orders you get, the bigger your total and the more half price stuff you can get and, and the more money, more free money you get to spend. So um, just let me know if you want a link sent to you, I'll fix you one and send it to you and you can get started on that. It's great. And then also I wanted to say if um, anybody is watching that um, has a business, owns a business, works for somebody, you know, in a, in a business, in an office or um, at, at the bank or, you know, at a dentist office, doctor's office, that kind of stuff. If you, I'm going to make up some Scentsy baskets um, just with uh, some information and a catalog and some samples and I've got the samples ordered, and I think they'll be here next week, and I want to start working on those this weekend, probably, and get some samples made and that kind of thing, and then I'm going to get some samples from um, from the consultant store of some of the washer whips and the dish soap and the body line and that kind of stuff, and fill it all up with that and maybe some candy and some gum and, and just make it real pretty and festive, and I'm going to take those to some of the businesses in Berea that I thought I think might enjoy it. So um, if you guys uh, know of any businesses that might want to um, might want a basket um, of some goodies, you just let me know and I will be happy to make one up and bring it to you. Um, but yeah, I want to get Cincy out there and share it with everybody because I love it so much. Okay, I love it so much. And y'all can laugh at me if you want to, I don't care. My long-term goal with Cincy is to be able to quit my job. That I, I want to quit my clocking in, time clock, in and out job. I want to be my own boss. I don't want to have to um, ask for a day off or ask if I can go to my doctor's appointment or ask if I can be off because my kid's got a doctor's appointment or he's sick or I want to go see my grandbabies in Ohio. I don't, I don't like, I don't like having to do all that. I am, um, I'm not an old woman, but I'm getting up there and I have grandbabies and I need to spend time with them and I want to be able to go when I want to. So that is my long-term goal is to be able to quit my job and work Cincy full time. That's my dream. That's my new dream job right there. And, um, that's my why. So if you think that you might like that as a side hustle or you just might want to get your own Cincy added, you know, you, you can call me and let me know and I'll be happy to talk to you. Or if you want to um, do whatever you want to do with, with Cincy, it's there for you. You can go big or you can go small and it's in, I'll cheer you on either way. And all the girls, all the wonderful ladies that I've met in this business are just what I said. They are wonderful. They are my friends. I, I look to them as friends, mentors. I can um, call them. I can text them. I can watch their, their lives and watch their trainings. And I've learned so much from them. And um, I'd love for y'all to go, go on your own journey with Cincy. It's great. I'm having a ball. And I love it. And I love you guys. And if you want more information about any of this that I've talked about or my um, my sample baskets that I'm making or um, any of the warmers that you've seen, just message me um, or go to my website and check it out and let me know if you have any questions or I can do anything at all for you. Okay? So I love you. Happy Friday. Have a great weekend. And I'll talk to you guys next week. Okay?